looking like a construction site, right? Got all these offcuts we just get rid of. Just get myself absolutely covered in <laughs> covered in mud. <laughs> So you heard us just running the machine, but I think the, it's pretty fine. We're going to try this, these meshes there, just because I think that we'll see, see how it goes. But this, this is sort of uh, the maggots in progress. And then this is the stuff that we've got to feed them, but it's quite fine. I don't know if it needs to be that fine. I want to try it with the other one so it doesn't take quite so long, and then we'll put it in the barrels to store it. Pretty good. So I thought I'd show you the maggots growing. I can find them. Yeah, there we go. See them all wriggling around. There's normally like an area where they concentrate. Oh, here we go. Look at this. Oh my goodness. There's a lot of maggots in here, which is good. So they're definitely consuming all the substrate. Um, I've got these screens for the rats or rodents, I should say. Um, that will definitely help, although we might need to... Look at that. <laughs> uh, we're, we're, we weren't 100% happy with them. These are just sem I think these are temporary because we just wanted to get them covered, but we will work on improving those. Um, three bays currently, and then this is where we're building our ex extension. Um, it's still setting a bit. It's a sort of rough base layer. Then we'll add some three more bays at least three more bays to that site, which would be good. It'll be slightly longer, I think, just so we can increase the height, because currently this is uh, 27 centimetres from there to there, so up to this point it's 27 centimetres. Um, but you want, I reckon, we, 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 the maximum we can get depth of substrate about 30 centimetres. Any lower than that, then the water starts to accumulate at the bottom, you get carbon dioxide, less oxygen, that type of thing. Um, but we want the lip to be sort of maybe 35 and then you don't fill it all the way to the top of the lip um, just so you can get the most substrate in but yeah it looks okay um, happy enough and good the machine works and looking like a construction site right got these off cuts we need to get rid of um, and then the polytone I can almost imagine what it's going to look like oh, they've put the I noticed this they put the sort of step here as well so we've got some bricks around the door type of thing so yeah it's working all right so the pond's looking empty uh it's mostly been done just get myself absolutely covered in <laughs> covered in mud <laughs> um but it's basically sort of up to a meter I think but we need to add so this extra bit of length depth here you can see we're going to do a bit more to make sure it is the right depth. I bought a gift a laser thanks David you know who you are um, give me this so that should allow us to measure the height a bit more accu accurately um, so yeah start measuring it and see how we do and we're just about to sample our fingerlings for the first time just to see the growth rate they're looking decent. The scoop net and the weighing scales. And then we'll see. We don't want to stress these ones out. But, uh, yeah, I think we've got about 50, which is what we're hoping to sample. That's about 5% of the population in here. Uh, so, so, yeah, it's good. 